you go into the detail, we actually find that, for example, people from Asian ethnic backgrounds are more likely to get some cancer types. And those include things like gallbladder, liver and some types of blood cancer. So it is really important to both look at the big picture and then zoom into those specific cancer types and really see what's happening. These sort of studies aren't done very often. You, you did yours after 10 years. Mm-hmm. How much do you think we do need to break these down into the different ethnic groups to find out specifically what's going on? Yeah, it's really important. Um, I mean, this is really important to notice first that this is very reliable and high quality data. And that's why it does take so much time. You know, if you're going to produce data like this and research like this, it takes a lot of a lot of time and a lot of resource. And um, but it's so important to better understand cancer inequalities and where we need to work harder to address them. Um, as you said, this research looked at broad ethnic groups. So Asian groups, it looked at all Asian groups, including South Asian groups, but also um, Pakistani, um, uh, all of the different kind of sections of um, of ethnic groups within that broader category. Uh, the difficulty you come to when you look at very specific groups is the data gets less, obviously, because you're kind of zooming in more. Um, so yes, it's very important, but we also need to work with the data that we have um, to draw those conclusions.